Okay, so good evening and welcome. It is Fresh Juice right here on Joy Prime Multi TV. My name is Movi the Motivator, and today, without wasting any time, one person that we would like to celebrate because it's WCW, as you already know, obviously. We're going to celebrate a woman. But today, we're celebrating one of our own. Um, well, her name is Miss Eunice Foley. It's her birthday today. She's an uh, acting head of production and a personal friend, uh, a great mother. She's an amazing, hardworking woman. And we here on Fresh Juice say, Eunice, you rock, man. You're, you're the, should I say, hottest milk ever. <laughs> and we are celebrating you. Now, Eunice is, like I said, acting head of production at Multi-TV, Joy Prime, and at Doom TV, an old student of NAFTI, and a proud mother. Eunice is a great and industrious woman worth celebrating. Happy birthday, Miss Foley, Fresh Juice, and the whole team, obviously, we want to wish you a very happy birthday. So there you have it. If you know Eunice, make sure that you are sending her birthday wishes. But Eunice, seriously, you and I, we go way back, you know, and I want to wish you everything you wish for me because, no, a million times, because I know you wish nothing but the best for me. And it humbles me that you're such a lovely, kind-hearted woman. Well, we're moving on to the juice, as that's why I'm here. Today, I'm going to about you, not today. Well, this week, she made headlines because she said that she's still working on her acting skills and that Ghanaian should give her time. And I agree. You know, sometimes you just need a little time to grow in your shoes. Um, everyone has their opinion. I am so learning. I, that, as for that, I keep saying that I always find new ways to learn. Yeah. So um, it's five years and counting. Mm -hmm. And um, I've worked with other people. I've worked exactly. with so many people. So, I mean, not everybody would like you. Exactly. But I'm still learning. So exactly. if you didn't like the previous movie, trust me, you would like the next one. All right. It's always a process. <laughs> Do you know what? Oh, in fact, you don't mind them. They are worse actresses on TV, like seriously. And they're getting all the recognition. Like, I'm like, come on, man. Is this the best we could do? So, Juan Fe Patria, actually, in my, should I, top 20 actresses in Ghana. Yeah, you're in there somewhere. I'm not going to tell you which number, though. But um, Kwame Eugene is, um, I wouldn't say making excuses, because I've heard so many people, you know, um, judge uh, what's going on with Lynx Entertainment um, signee Kwame Eugene saying that he's a copycat. I even said it. But, yeah, personally, he kind of translated the whole song into tree, which is a good thing because now, for those of you who don't understand English, watch it, ice prints, and then you watch it, and watch it, and tree. So why are we complaining? He's actually a gift to Ghana, and we should celebrate him. But he said, no, I just got inspiration from ice prints. I did not plagiarize his lyrics. After releasing his confusion song in February this year, he was accused of stealing a song from a Malian musician, Siddiqui, and the same story was said about his Killing Me Softly track, which featured singer Adina. But in an interview, um, Kwame Eugene did not be a plagiarist and that he rather took inspiration from him. So, you know, we like to gossip of our celebrities, not because, you know, we like to see their downfall or anything. Not on this show, by the way. We don't do that here. We give advice. We take, you know, 
basically life lessons. You learn things from this show. And then we also take, you know, should I say inspiration from those who are doing something good. All right. So let's not, you know, um, tag Fresh Juice as we troll people or mock people or diss people. We don't do that here. But anyway, one of my favorite celebrity couples right here in Ghana is Medical. And I don't know whether you heard it on radio, but I was the first to call them Debical. And um, yeah, I'm still following them. And I pray that they do, you know, walk down the aisle at some point. But it's sad to say that Medical revealed that marriage isn't his thing. But apparently he has a very tangible explanation for that utterance that he made in an interview. Now, you did tweet that you just might not get married, medical. Yeah, I might, I might not get. Oh, I was just, I was just kidding. It was oh. one of them things. Is, oh. is it, is it because I, I fat farted on you in the bedroom? No, 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 it's not. No. You did what? <laughs> farted. Ew. Really? No, I'm joking. <laughs> you know, sometimes I think that if you are with a girl and then you lo love each other and then you are together, then yeah, you know, you no need to, you know, go to some extra mile again and then. You know, because people they get married and get divorced. Sometimes I think I, I think out loud, so I I say some stuff. Mm. But, you know, it's not that deep. You know? It's called commitment, darling. Yeah, marriage is for grown ups, so it means you are forever young. Jay Z Paul to Dominion, no why are Beyonce? Now I want anything more where I put you on the Oh Debbie, don't take that. You are worth being walked out my eye with. You know what I mean? Someone should be able to say to you that I cannot live without you. And that's taking you down the aisle and doing the right thing, basically. And I pray that if that's what you want, you get it. But Shatawale, <sighs> Shatawale also is one of the couple. Well, Shatawale and Michi are another celebrity couple. I would like to see wedding photos, you know, um, crowding the whole social media space. But it looks like um, Shatawale is not really perturbed by what the public say about his status. He says that, yeah, that's so what Michi and I, we are still very much together. So don't be fooled. It's a marriage. Huh. Anybody will take marriage like it is swag. Because we see go wear coat, you do one wear coat and cut picture. Yeah, there you go, can't tell me. I was mean, telling my girl that, babe, we've, we've, we've been married, though. forget, like God has married us. It's just up to the time where I'll say I'm ready to put, yeah, okay, take you to. But I don't have even that time to even show people that I'm marrying my. I can go and sign and keep it like that. If I tell you today that me and Shatamisha have signed and we are married, you won't believe. I get what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. But people always keep saying, when will you marry? When will you, how do you want me to marry the thing? The thing, when I saw the thing, I married the thing and the thing was okay. And I keep marrying it. I'm with the thing. And we have created something out of the thing. And the thing have going to a big something. So what is people want to see? Nothing. You haven't seen it because you, I can't waste my time and think about, hey, if I don't marry Nasha, God, no go talk to me again. Hey, I can't do that. So you guys are still together? Very sweetly happy. And sometimes when I see you, I go like, are you not happy? You have a man. And I was a machine. Yes. <laughs> oh, you both have mansions. Yes, you live in a machine. Like, we're going business. Hi. So, what is it? Some people go and marry and they go and borrow money. You don't want to marry and borrow car. But, but you know, on her Instagram handle, mm. she's written that she's single. Yes. Free from oppression. That is that is how she is. She too, she has some lifestyle. What lifestyle is that? And like some female angel. What's that? I don't know why she based on that. I like, I like her lifestyle. You know, she's also like that. You know, she's, mm -hmm. she's the hard type like me. I think she's my opposite side, but she understands, you know, mm. and I keep telling her, we shouldn't think of people, you know, we can get married right now, but when we get married, what next? They're quarreling, we are doing it already. They miss another. Standing side. Right now, we are going to put ourselves into the school, and right now, we will act like the way married people do. No, these are the these are the Then we have to go and see counselor. Counselor, can he's not me, he's not me, he's not me. I can't do that, baby. Yeah. So, honestly, Shatawale, hmm, Shatawale, you are something else, for real. And you, if you say that Michi is your exact, you know, like photocopy, she's just like you, but you know, female version of yourself, then. You guys are two peas in a pod because I remember reading tweets from her saying that, um, you know, you were ungrateful and, you know, all kinds of horrible things. So if that's what you two are into, no, no, I worry easy. I'll be so papa, papa. Yeah, they will really thrive. Anyway, Stone Boy, ah, he has done me proud. So 
You know how everyone has been talking about gospel, yeah, the gospel fraternity, have been talking about how you should not mix with the circular and all of that. Well, Obapa Christie is about to make history in Ghana because I think he's going to get one of the best artists we have here in Ghana to collaborate with her. And I'm so happy to announce that it's no other than Stone Boy. <laughs> Ghanaian gospel musician Obapa Christie some weeks ago expressed her interest in to collaborate with Sakodie and Stoneboy for her new album. However, reggae dancehall artist has responded to Obapa Christie's request, saying he's ever ready to collaborate with her. And this is what Stoneboy said, and please allow me to quote, I am so honored and would want to sing with her because musicians need each other's support to grow and serve the masses with good music. <laughs> I love Stone Boy and I'm so psyched. I mean, Stone Boy already to me is doing gospel music because he does not preach profanity. It, I don't care whether you say Stone Boy is a snake on the grass. I like him a lot. You know what I mean? But seriously though, if he is on Obapa Christie's, oh my God, I cannot even imagine. It is blowing my mind. Let me continue to just marinate on that thought. When we come back from the break, there's more right here on Fresh Juice. Welcome back from the break. Today we have a very important interview and I'm psyched to bring this to you. But before that, let me say a very big thank you to the people who make this show what it is. First of all, it's God. Then Colleen Professional Makeup, obviously. I'd like to thank Double Chris Collection for my beautiful top. Yes, I love you. She's in the former pool bar premises on the Spintex Road. Elite Studios, right opposite the Texpo Market or the Texpo Police Station. Eno is right upstairs. Find her and she'll make you look this gorgeous. Obviously, I do my makeup every single day. But remember, my nails is by Lady One Year. Mission right here at Caprice. Find her. Like seriously, girl makes me feel like, you know, Lady Gaga. In a good way though. But <laughs> I am psyched to say that, should I say, laughter fest did, couldn't have come at a better time, you know? And I'm so, so thrilled to have the head of uh, retail sales in Accra, Mr. Carte Caesar. Welcome to the show, sir. Thank you. And you look very, you know, dope. Like, I mean, you have all the laughter things in your shirt. So this means that serious business. Exactly. Fantastic. There's so much buzz about, you know, Laughter Fest. Uh, what is it? <laughs> well, Laughter Fest, sorry. Laughter Fest is the biggest and largest African comedy show mm. that's been happening in Nigeria and is being brought to Ghana. And we're bringing biggest stars, all the top rated stars mm. in Nigeria, Ghana, Uganda, Tanzania, all under one roof. Wow. So where is yes, it taking place? At the Fantasy Dome at okay. the Trade Fair. Right. 4 p.m. sharp on Sunday, okay, 12th so of August. Fantastic. Yeah, yes. So how can a Glow subscriber attend this show? Well, if you're a Glow subscriber, all you need to do is to recharge 20 Ghana CDs and use it for voice. Just mm -hmm. use it and make calls. And then you would uh, qualify to enter. Or if you want to use data, it means you got to use 30 Ghana CDs of data and voice. Okay. And then you would qualify. In a whole week? In a whole, I mean, within the month that the oh, event okay. is taking place, okay. actually. And then anybody who is not a Glow subscriber, mm -hmm. you can still walk to our Glow World shops. Mm -hmm. You can walk to any of our retail points, any of our channel members, retailers on the street. Right. We have canvases on the street. Okay. Just get a Glow SIM, load it with um, uh, what we call credit, okay, yeah. and make some calls, or buy data on it and use it, and that's it. So, or you can come to the event. Okay. And buy a preloaded SIM of 3.2 gig, which goes for 30 Ghana cities. Yeah. So you can walk to the event on Sunday evening. Our our ladies will be there to sell you a pre-bundled SIM, and that will be your ticket to enter the event. So how, 30 would, Ghana how would a subscriber know if they're qualified? Well, to very simple. Once you qualify, you use your 20 Ghana cities for calls or 30 Ghana cities for calls and browsing or whatever data, you eat it up, you get a nice SMS telling you that you're qualified. And then we followed up with a call as well. 
or it will call you first and the SMS follows. So and, that, and you show it at the event gates. Okay. Right. So does it cover family and friends? Well, it covers just one person. Oh I mean, dear. We all use, a number is for only one person. So only one person qualifies. But then you are allowed to buy different sims mm -hmm. for your family and friends so that they can also attend. So are there other shows to come? Yes, there are a lot more shows. In, in August, we're having two shows. There's the mega music show, which is on the 25th. And so if you qualify for the month of mm -hmm. August, you're going for the laughter fest and you're going for the mega m m music as well, mm -hmm. all in one month. In September, two shows. Laughter fest in September, m mega music also in September, two shows. All you've got to do is to use up that data bundle and qualify for September show. And then there's a combo, a huge one, mm -hmm. both Laughter Fest and Mega Music under one roof all together October 20th. So how can people attend all five shows? All you've got to do is to qualify. I mean, we set the criteria, very low level criteria. Everybody can meet it. 20 Ghana cities in August, 20 Ghana cities in September, 20 Ghana cities in October. There's a 60 Ghana cities. We want to give something out to Ghanaians. We want to do something that nobody has done. These are great, huge stars. You understand what I'm saying? And if they are performing, people charge a lot to have people come watch them. We're just telling you that we are giving you free data on a sim. Mm. Use it and additionally, come and... Thank you so much, yes. Mr. Carte Caesar. That's it. Lovely talking to you. Very well, well, we Thank are still too. celebrating our WCW of the day, of course. Miss Eunice Foley, yes to you again. laughing because Charlie, I'm not even attending the glow, uh, you know, laughter fest, but I'm right here in my studio's fresh juice, of course, but I'm laughing already because I have two people who are going to be performing uh, on Sunday, apparently. Yep. Oh my goodness, Foster Romanos! Dance all settings, dance all rocket, dance all comedy, you're representing glow, laughter fest, you don't know. Shatawale <laughs> or something? Uh, Rambo style, you see. <laughs> Yes, I, uh, <laughs> Chemical is also here. Yeah, yeah, We've yeah, seen I'm you in uh, yeah. some ads, man. Yeah, yeah. What's popping? Yeah, you know, um, Glow Laughter Fest is popping on the 12th. Right. Sunday, Fantastic Glow. I mean, all the stars. Mm -hmm. we, we want you to start meeting. Foster all across Road. Africa, all you know what I'm saying? Basket out. You know, Salvador, wow. Virginia. Bucci, um, uh, Dan the Humor, Bucci, I want to know. No, Bucci is the Nigerian okay. also, but he's not on this one. Yeah. Okay. So it's just Basque Mouth, mm -hmm. you have Dan the Humor, Sailo, right. then you have Salvador from Uganda, right. Chemical, mm -hmm. myself, DKB, Jacinta, right. rapping, you know what I'm saying? Wow, yeah. so talk to, I mean, you have to crack some jokes. So oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start a joke, uh, oh, but please. I won't end it. Hey, so they have to okay. come. No, they have to uh, come there. We'll just shoot <laughs> and then when they come, I'll finish the joke for them. You know? wow. yeah, yeah, because okay. yeah. So uh, make, you go start or make us start. No start. Start. Okay. So you see, there's this boy. The boy's mother put money under a pillow. Uh -huh. And then one day, the boy's mother was going to look for the money. Mm -hmm. Then when she went there, the money was not there. Was it her pillow? I don't even know. Okay. So come to the show. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I had more questions. Chemical. Oh, you, you can ask the question. I'll answer them for you. Yeah. <laughs> Chemical, what about you? Something little for our viewers. Mm -hmm. Oh, um, what's mm -hmm. You continue, my dear. I don't continue anything. <laughs> oh. The money is still under the pillow, uh -huh. so if you want to know. No, the woman went there. 
I mean, just, just, was not come, there. just come and just come. <laughs> you will just come. I mean, <laughs> I mean, with the best stand-up comedy events host right here. I mean, what yo, I'm saying, yo, I'm saying, yo, I'm saying, yo, yeah. 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 So please, yeah. just, just, just make it a point. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. going to be rape cracking. Kenny yeah, bringing the toxic yeah. uh, substances there. So yeah, I know wow. you are going to be there. So Thank you so yeah. much. Thank you Thank too you for so coming much. on our show. <laughs> so, um. We we'll just go over a quick commercial break. Yeah, we're we done with that. But we, ah, that's okay. all we got time for today. Thank you so much. My name is Moby the Motivator. Whatever you yeah. do, make sure you're putting God first. Motivator. I'm done. Maybe. Ah, uh, motivator. Okay. I thought. <laughs> Biology classic. Amy say you blow, and the demon say you pass it. Are you ready? Uh, let's go. Till it done. Coco, coco, till it done. Cotillidon, 